this video is for students uh, taking IPC 144 at Seneca College. Uh, in this video, I will show you how to transfer a file that is on your computer in front of you onto uh, Matrix. So to do this, we need, a, we need an FTP program, and there are many, many, many out there. So the one that I'm using right now is called FileZilla. Now, when you start up FileZilla, what you will see is uh, a screen like the one in front of me. It shows you um, what files you have here. It isn't connected to uh, any machine at this moment. So let's make it. Let's establish first a connection between your local computer and Matrix. To do this, we go to the Site Manager, which you can access through this button on the top left corner here, and it brings up the Site Manager. Uh, file. Uh, other programs will have something similar where you can enter um, a site's uh, address. So um, now I actually have a profile set up for Matrix, but because this is the first time I'm going to do a new one with you. And how you do that is you hit new site and then you fill in your host name. The host name is matrix.senecac.om.ca. Um, Matrix does not support regular FTP, so make sure you're using S, uh, SFTP here. So drop the box down and do that. The logon type is not anonymous. You have a user ID, so we're going to change this one to normal. And then we are going to use your Seneca ID, not the full address, just your name part, and then your password. So once we filled all these boxes in, we hit the connect button and the program will establish a connection to the to the uh, to matrix. And you can see the status of how this is going over here. If you type in the wrong password, for example, it would actually like say you uh, can't connect. So this is the this is my home directory on matrix. These are all the files that I have. And I want to transfer a file from my local machine, one of these files over here. So um, I obviously need to find a place to put them. Now um, I'm going to create a folder here called My Stuff. So go to Create Directory. There are ways to do this. If you already have a directory where all your uh, files should go, you simply have to navigate to that directory here. So um, create this and navigate down to it. Now, as I just created this folder, there is nothing on here at this moment. And what I want to do is I want to transfer a program that I wrote on my local machine over. Now, the program, the source code for this program, the things that I typed in, is in this file, hello.c. The executable a.0 was created when I compiled hello.c and turned it into an executable. However, I don't want to transfer the executable because it's not going to run on Matrix anyways. They're two different machines. The local machine uh, for me is my Mac, and Matrix happens to be a Linux machine. The, the executable will not run. So all you want to do is transfer only source files. So here I have hello.c. I'm going to drag this over, and that's all I have to do. Just simply drag the file that you want to transfer over to the right-hand side. And that's it. Now my file is here. If I go onto our matrix, I can see that I have a folder called my stuff right here. And if I go into it, I now have a file in it called hello.c. And I can then compile the program here to generate the a.out, the executable. And there we go. The file is now, the program now exists and I can run it here. Uh, that's everything. Thank you.